music discourse, am I right? I've seen a lot of music discord lately about how music critics are too harsh on fun pop music and artists like Megan Trainer or Bever Rexa because it's not high hearts that they expect from uh, such a pop artist. And as much as this kind of debate seems fruitless to me, it made me thought uh, something. All these artists and bands that are, that are the popular consensus seems to ignore and critics take for granted. What is their history? Because I do believe that all art, or not, impacts history in some way or another. Like, did you know that Queen's Hot Space was one of the reasons Michael Jackson made Thriller? And we all know how good Hot Space is! Hi, my name is Triss. And I'm starting a whole new series in order to talk about these C-tier pop divas, these unsung MCs, and those butt rock art artists. Welcome to Midstory. So, how is it gonna work exactly? Well, I will go on Rate Your Music, look up the singles of the artists I want to talk about, and select their 5 best rated and 5 worst rated, and then talk give my honest thoughts on all 10 songs. That way I can create myself an idea of the consensus on an artist, trying to analyze if there's any negative bias or not, and create a relationship with his artist's work. Each episode's artist will also have an underlying question I'll try to answer, as not all artists are regarded to be mediocre for the same reasons. So far, I'm probably not gonna accept requests for artists to be featured on the show, but who knows, I might change my mind. That's it for the presentation, stay tuned for the premiere of this series somewhere at the end of the month or in February. See you around.